we're trying to figure out what's the least possible value of k. So you want to multiply this really small number by 10 to the k, where it's a whole number. It's an integer. You don't want any decimals. So what we need to do is switch to scientific notation. So, or form of it. The first number would be 25 times 10. That's a times, guys. 10 to the uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, negative 4. And then this one is going to be 25 times 10 to the negative 3. And then 25 times 10 to the 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, negative 5. And we're trying to figure out what K is. So we've got 25 cubed. And then we've got 10 to the, when you multiply like bases, you add your exponents. So negative 4 minus negative 7, that's negative 12. So it's times 10 to the negative 12 times 10 to the k. Well, 25 times q, 25 cubed is some whole number, but you're multiplying it by 10 to the negative 12. And I wouldn't do, I know right now my answer is, is 12 because 10 to the negative 12 times 10 to the positive 12 is 10 to the zero because you add your exponents, which is one. So that would make 25 cubed a whole number. Does that make sense? Because it says, like, k could also be 13. That would work, but it says the least possible value of k. So k is 12.